A 60,000 bushel grain bin with faces of real farmers on the side is definitely a sight to see. That's what Farm Progress Show visitors will be greeted with when, they, when, it, when the three-day event starts August 31st. WCI3's ag reporter Stu Ellis is on the road to Farm Progress and provides this preview. Good morning, everyone. We're on the road to Farm Progress, and we are here at Progress City, where there's a lot of new artwork going up at the Brock Bin up on the northeast corner of Progress City. Sean Gerhardt, district manager for Brock, uh, is uh, with us, and you've got a picture of some special farmers. Yes, we certainly do. Welcome to Progress City and Farm Progress 2021. Uh, as you can see behind us, we've got uh, the Jinx family being featured as uh, the Brock Grain Systems uh, featured farmer this year. So Why are they there? We took a pause this year uh, in planning for this, this event and thought about, you know, who, who are we really here for and why are we here? And uh, the answer was obviously pretty clear, evidently pretty quickly, and, and that is because of the great American farmer. So, you know, our, our, uh, our goal this year is to, to promote and say thanks and play homage to those hardworking uh, farmers who get up day in and day out, you know, pandemic or not, and uh, go to work every day to provide food for us uh, at the grocery store. And when they get to the Brock exhibit and admire the artwork, <laughs> what are they going to see? Anything new that, uh, that you're providing this year? Yeah, we're pretty excited, actually. We're going to be debuting a brand new uh, moisture sensor for our grain dryers. Um, this is something we've been working on uh, for, for quite a while, um, day in and day out, obviously, through last year or two. And um, like I said, it's a new moisture sensor that uh, paired with our, you know, current controller, the IntuiDry, we really feel like it's gonna deliver a, a really nice uh, product to, for farmers to be able to dry their grain uh, at harvest time. So, um, you know, like I said, that, that's gonna be something brand new to the, uh, to the farming community, and we're excited to, uh, to show it. All right, Sean Gerhardt with Brock. We uh, certainly invite you to come look at the uh, Jinx family uh, photo and check out that new uh, uh, technology they've got for sensing moisture in grain dryers. That's our report from the farm on this road to farm progress. This is Stu Ellis with WCIA3, your local news leader.